Good morning and welcome to the Committee on Land Use. I am Council Member Francisco Moya, Chair of Zoning uh, Subcommittee, and I will be filling in for the Land Use Committee Chair, uh, Chair Salamanca, today. I want to welcome my esteemed colleagues who are here, uh, the members of the committee. Uh, we have uh, Council Member Ku, Lansman, Levin, Miller, Richards, Grudenchek, Adams, Ayala, and Council Member Chin. I want to thank uh, Chair Adams for her work on uh, our Landmarks Subcommittee. Uh, today we will, be vo we will vote to approve with modifications LU614, the 2513-2523 Avenue O rezoning proposal relating to property in Council Member Deutsch's district. The application uh, seeks, to, uh, uh, seeks approval for a zoning map amendment to change an R2 zoning district to an R32 district on Avenue O between Bedford Avenue and 26th Street in the Midwood section of Brooklyn. Our modification will be to change the proposed R32 district to an R31 district. The R31 use and bulk regulations would address the legalization of an existing office while adhering more closely to the prevailing character of surrounding blocks. Uh, we will vote to approve LUs uh, 606 through 608 for the Go Broom development relating uh, to property in Council Member Chin's district. The application includes requests for a zoning special permit to allow certain bulk waivers within a large-scale residential development, a zoning map amendment to change an R8 district to an R91 C25 district, and a zoning text amendment to allow quality housing development within a large-scale residential development and to establish an MIH area uh, utilizing option one. The requested action would facilitate the development of two mixed-use buildings in Lower East Side neighborhood of Manhattan, including approximately 488 dwelling units, of which approximately 43% will be income restricted, community facility space, office space, and ground floor retail. We will vote to approve LU 609 for the uh, 503 Broadway zoning special permit, also relating to property in Council Member Chin's district. The application for a special permit to allow large retail use in an M15B district would facilitate the legalization of a multi-story retail establishment within an existing building in the Soho neighborhood of Manhattan. We will also vote to approve LU10, the Bridge Park, sorry, uh, we will also vote to approve LU610, the Bridge Park South mapping proposal relating to property in Council Member Gibson's district. The application seeks approval of an amendment to the city map and to demap portions of Exterior Street and West 101st Street and together with three adjacent vacant city owned lots to map such areas as parkland. Uh, these actions would facilitate the expansion of Bridge Park and the Harlem River Greenway in the High Bridge neighborhood in the Bronx. Uh, we will also vote to approve LU 625, the Trotería del Arte application for a revocable consent to maintain, operate, and use an unenclosed sidewalk cafe at 900 7th Avenue in Council Member Powers' district in Manhattan. Two applications assigned to our zoning subcommittee have been withdrawn. They are LU 624, an application for a revocable consent for a sidewalk cafe, Bluestone Lane. The Department of Consumer Affairs has submitted a withdrawal recommendation and our action will be to file the matter, removing it from our calendar. Uh, with regard to LU 636 and C7 Baychester Avenue rezoning, the Department of City Planning has submitted a letter of withdrawal. Uh, accordingly, we will be filing this matter as well, removing it from our calendar. Our landmark subcommittee will vote to approve LU 615, an application submitted pursuant to Section 1732 of the New York School Construction Authority Act. It concerns a proposed site selection for a new approximately 322-seat primary school facility located at 6440 3rd Avenue in Brooklyn within Community School District 20, uh, Community District 10 in Council Member Brandon's district. Uh, are there any questions or remarks uh, from members of the committee? Council Member Chin. Thank you, uh, Council Member Moya. I just wanted to really thank the subcommittee for holding the long hearing. <laughs> <laughs> I have two items back to back. And for the committee support uh, yesterday on the two item in my district. And especially, I think, for the Go Broom project, and you've heard the chair mention uh, the percentage of affordable housing. We're going to have, um, you know, 
a whole building of senior housing, mixed room uh, housing, but we also got them to set aside 30% for formerly homeless seniors and families. And also the uh, synagogue, the historic um, H, I, I don't want to miss, uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Council member Gurdendrick helped me with the pronunciation. The Beth Ham Madrash Hagado Synagogue <laughs> will be rebuilt as a cultural center there. And that is a site that is so deeply beloved by the community. And it was destroyed by a fire uh, a couple years back and were able to to rebuild uh, a community center to continue that, and also a permanent home for the Chinese American Planning Council, who has been providing, you know, community service. One of the largest, the largest social service agency um, in the East Coast, and for us, like, they've been providing services for more than 50 years, and now they will have a permanent home. So those are the significance uh, in the project, and also the one. So I really urge uh, my colleague uh, to support both of these projects. The one in Soho, um, there were a lot of negotiation and a lot of engagement, and we finally did get a lot of commitment uh, from the, uh, the developers. So I really urge my colleague to support. Thank you. Uh, I now call for a vote in accordance with the recommendations of the subcommittee and uh, local council members to approve LU 606, 607, 608, 609, 610, 615, and 625 to approve with modifications I've described, LU uh, 614, and to file LU 624 and LU 336. Uh, will the clerk please call the roll? <coughs> William Martin, committee clerk, roll call vote committee on land use. All items are coupled. Council member Moya. Uh, aye on all. Koo. Aye. Lanceman. Aye. Levin. Aye. Miller. Aye. Richards. Aye. Gordenchik. Aye. Adams. Aye. Ayala. Aye. By a vote of nine in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. All items have been adopted as indicated on today's agenda. So we're going to keep the, the rolls open for another uh, 15 minutes. <laughs> 